Hey guys, um, I'm back with another video here. Um, this is gonna be a DVD slash VHS update. I've got three DVD, I mean three VHS tapes and four DVDs. Um, first off, I just want to say I'm gonna make another video, but it's gonna be. I know I don't normally do this, but it's gonna be a book slash CD update because I got. One CD and I got a couple of books I want to show and just so I can make this video and make it I, It'll give you guys two videos to look at and it'll give me like Some time I have like <clears throat> um To get through them quicker So I decided to just do this just to be its own their own separate updates So first up are the um DVDs and VHS tapes, but first is the first VHS tape is Caillou the Everyday Hero. Um, it says it's supposed to come with the parent guy, but it doesn't. But I'm not like too upset about that. I really could care less. I mean, it would have been cool to look through, but <clears throat> whatever. Here's the site, and actually, the one reason I picked this up, I mean, I would have picked it up anyway. Is because I fig I thought it was gonna be rare. I don't think it is because it came out in 2006, and that's like at the very end of VHS tapes. But either way, I mean it's still pretty cool. I mean I like the older episodes better, but there's a lot of episodes on here, 90 minutes. So yeah, that was pretty cool. There's the tape. And the print date right there on um, March 10th, 2006. So yeah, it's getting, it's one of the last VHS tapes, I believe. Okay, next are up are, okay, the next tape, sorry guys, my mind's kind of all over the place. But my next tape is Bob the Builder, Bob's Favorite Adventures, like I said. I got into Bob the Builder, I was like... Okay, I'll get one or two tapes, and then, like, if I find them anywhere else, I might pick them up here and there. And then ever since that day, I've, like, done nothing but found Bob the Builder tapes. And me, my being stupid, just have to, I have to pick them up. But, I don't know, whatever. But I do like these, like, favorite adventures tapes, but I have one for, like, everybody on the show, like, the main characters. This is like my, let me see, I think this is my third, I'm pretty sure, of one of these tapes. I have this one, Rolly's Favorite Adventures, and I have Lofty's Favorite Adventures. <clears throat> There's the back. There's the tape. And the print date is... July eighth, two July eighth, two thousand and four. You can't really see it now, but like it's it. But July eighth, two thousand and four. Okay, next up is Bob saves the day. For some reason in my area, I know I think I've said this before in the last video. They I can't find like the little hard shell, like clam shell type cases. For some reason, but I can find them in like slip covers. Not too mad about that, but like I'd rather have them in the clamshells. But whatever, there's the tape. And the print date on this is January 2nd, 2003. I believe, I'm not really sure, but. Yeah, that's it for the VHS tapes. And first up is... Now, next up are the DVDs. And the first one is... What's New Scooby-Doo Monstros Monstrous Tales? I don't know if I'm going to continue. I have, like... This is, like, my second one of these volumes of What's New Scooby-Doo. I have the second season, but I might just get... Forget these and buy, like, the... First season and the third season because there are only three. But here are the episodes, and this is volume 10, and it says it's the final volume, so I'm guessing these are the last episodes. 
There's the tape, I mean the DVD. And the episodes. Yeah, this is like my second snapper case DVD. Okay, next up is Chicken Little. I know a lot of people didn't really like this movie. It came out at the time that like Disney, like you would think, you would thought they would like running out of ideas. But to be honest, I really enjoyed Chicken Little. I mean, I think it's kind of a cool little movie to look at every once in a while. There's the disc. I did have this DVD before when I was younger, but like I, I don't really know what happened to it. We might have sold it or something. I'm not sure. Okay, the next two I actually got. I made this video originally, and then I decided to do it and in include these, and then make them like separate because I had so much stuff. So, like other stuff, like books and stuff. So I decided to do like two updates but like I'm they're gonna be individually titled I mean I'm not gonna be it's not gonna be like part one or two or nothing but these two I got yesterday at Walt I mean um Goodwill and first up is 51st Dates and as you can see down there I have it on VHS I might get rid of that I kinda just picked it up on DVD just trying to get all my tapes that I have get most of them on DVD with the ones I like the like the most I actually haven't finished this movie I watched like 30 minutes of it and I kind of stopped looking at it but there's the disc so yeah I mean it looks like it was pretty good movies from what I saw so okay next up is the last thing the last DVD and that is boogeyman don't really know too much about this movie. I did see a little bit of it on um, TV a while back. But it has, what was his name, um, Barry Watson. The guy who, I don't know if you know, anybody really watches this show or knows about it. But that show, Seventh Heaven, if you've heard of it, he was like the oldest brother in that. And I really enjoy that show. So I decided to get this just because he was in it and it looked kind of cool. There's that. Okay, and that is it um, for this update. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. Oh, and one more thing. I actually have something coming in the mail. I will unbox it, depending on... I, but it's from Amazon, so it should be packaged in like a box. It's kind of a bigger item. But I will be showing you this with this for my phone. I'll be shooting it with my phone, but then... It'll be cool when you see what it is. I think it's pretty cool. So yeah, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.